Now we're gonna work on words that use the magic E rule. The magic E rule says that the E at the end of a word is silent, but changes the way that the vowel in the middle of the word is pronounced. Strike, if you took off the E, would be pronounced strick, but because the E is on the end of the word, it makes the I say its name. So you have the long sound I, not the short sound I. That would be strick, but that's strike. Strick, strike. Same thing here. If there were no E on it, that would be bick. But because there's an E on the end, it makes the I say its name. I, bike. E on the end makes the U say its name. It doesn't say fum, it says fume. It doesn't say plum, it says plume because of the E. The E makes the vowel in the middle say its name, which is its long sound, not its short sound. Also, it can change an actual word like bit to bite, or rob to robe, cub to cube, tub to tube, cut to cute, hug to huge, hop to hope, tap to tape, or kit to kite. If you notice, all the first words have a short vowel sound because there's no E on the end. But once you put the E on the end, it makes that vowel in the center say its name, its long vowel sound. Now it also changes when you're adding suffixes onto a word. So, for example, when adding a suffix that begins with a vowel, we take away the magic E. So if you have the word take and you want to change it to taking, you have to remove the E to add the ing. So take plus ing becomes taking. See, there's no E on it anymore. So when you add the ing, you got to take off the E. Take becomes taking. Have plus ing becomes having, because there's no e anymore. You had to take it off. Have, remove the e, add the ing, becomes having. Make plus ing becomes making. Make becomes making. The e's gone. However, if the suffix begins with a consonant, we keep the magic e. For example, in lovely, lovely keeps the E because L-Y starts with a consonant, not a vowel. The ing starts with a vowel. I is a vowel. But the L in L-Y is a consonant. So if you're adding on the L-Y, which starts with a consonant, then you keep the E. Love becomes lovely and you still have the E. Care becomes careless because the L is a consonant, not a vowel. So care becomes careless and you still have the E. If the suffix that you're adding starts with a vowel, you got to remove the E, but if the suffix you're adding starts with a consonant, you keep the E. Okay, let's orthographic map some words that have the magic E rule. Our first word is strike. 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 Er, Ike. That's 
five sounds. S, t, er, I, k. Strike is what they say when you're playing baseball and you strike out. They say strike. the silent E or the magic E, however you want to say it. This E is making that I say its name. It's not I, it's not a short vowel sound, it's a long vowel sound, I. It's not strike, it's strike. St, er, ike. St, er, ike. I'm putting the E in the box with a K because you can't hear the E. And if you can't hear it, it doesn't get a sound box. It has to go in with the K. St, er, Ike. St, er, Ike. Strike. St, er, I. Er, Ike, strike. Good job. The next word is bike, bike, b ike, b ike, b ike. Three sounds. B ike. B b. And remember. Our hand trick to know which way a B goes. B. I. K. The E goes inside with the K because you can't hear the silent E. The E makes the I say its name. B. I. K. B. I. K. Bite. I k with the silent E. B Ike. B Ike. Bike. Good job. The next word is spike, 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 spike. Spike. Four sounds. I. I k and the E goes in here because you can't hear it, but it makes the I say its name. Sp Ike Sp Ike Spike. A spike is like a sharp instrument that can be nailed into something. Sp I Silent E makes the I say its name. Sp Ike. Sp Ike. Spike. Good job.
The next word is crime. Crime. Er, I'm. Er, I'm. Er, I'm. Er, I'm. Four sounds. K, er, I, m. crime, you got to go to jail because it means you did something you're not supposed to. I Silent E. I'm I'm crime. Good job. Next word is time. Time. T I'm. T I'm. T I. M. Three sounds. T I. M. I mm, and silent E makes the I say its name. Doesn't look like an E, does it? T I'm t I'm time. And time is what you tell on a watch or a clock. You tell what time it is. I mm, and the silent E. E makes the I say its name. T I'm t I'm time. Good job. Next word is slime. 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 Four sounds. Slime. Slime is something that you play with. You can buy it or you can make it in science class. I and then silent E. E makes the I say its name. I'm I'm slime. I I'm slime. Good job. The next word is fume. Fume. You, mm. 
And because that U makes U, it must have a silent E on the end. Because the E is what's making it say its name. Otherwise, it would be FUM. Fume. 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 Fume is like a smell. You smell gas or something. It makes a fume. I like perfume makes a smell. Fume. 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 Good job. The next word is cope. 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 That's three sounds. Cope. To cope means to deal with something. If you're coping with something, you're Handling it. K o p. And because it's making its O sound, this would be cop. But the E makes the O say O instead of ah. K o p. K o p. Cope. O P sound E makes O say its name. K O P K O P Cope. Good job. word is rope. Rope. Er, ope. Er, ope. Er, ope. Er, ope. Rope. Three sounds. Er, o, p. It's got to have an E on the end because otherwise it'd be rop. And it's not rop, it's rope. The E makes the O say O. Rope. 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 O. Rope. Rope. The rope is a big, long, thick string that you can use to climb or or rope a horse or tie something up with rope the next word is mope mope mm oh mm oh mope if you're moping around, you're kind of being sluggish and not happy. If your mom says, stop moping around the house, it means get happy and go out and play. Mm -ope. Mope. Mm -ope. Three sounds. If I don't add an E on the end, that's mop. But we're not doing mop. We're going to mope. So we need a silent E to make the O say its name. Mope. 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 
O. P. M. O. P. Mope. Good job. Our next word is slope. 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 Four sounds. Slope. I don't add an E, that's slop. But we don't want slop, we want slope. The silent E turns the O into O instead of ah. Slope. Slope. Slope, like a ski slope. It's like a hill is a slope. Makes the O say its name. Sool Oak. Sool Oak. Slope. Good job. Next, next word is chase. Chase. Ch A. Ace. Three sounds. Ch. A. And what makes the ch sound? Ch. If you watched our digraph video, you would know ch is ch. The digraph ch makes the ch sound goes in one box because it's one sound. This is graphing sounds, not letters. So ch, a, s. Now if I left it like that, it'd say chas, but we want it to say chase, which means there's a silent E on the end, making the A say its name. Ch, ace, ch, ace. Chase. Ch. A. S. Digraph. Ace. Ch. Ace. Ch. Ace. Chase. Good job. Next is grape. Grape. G er ape. G er ape. G er ape. Four sounds. G er ape. A grape is a fruit that you can eat. It's sweet and it tastes really good. Sometimes it's sour. Sometimes they're purple. Sometimes they're white. Sometimes they're green. G. Great. G. Er. A. P. Now, if I don't put an E on the end, it'd say grap. But we're trying to spell great. So the silent E is why the A says its name. G er ape. G er ape. Great. Uppercase G. G er 
A P G er ape G er ape Great Good job The next word is cake Cake Would be cac. So we need an E on the end to make the A say its name. K ache. K ache. Cake. K A K cake. Like you eat cake at a birthday party. K ache. K ache. Cake. Good job. The next word is snake. 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 Four sounds. A K S mm, A K and the silent E makes the A say its name. S mm, A K S mm, A K a snake is a long, legless animal. And sometimes they're poisonous. So you want to be careful around a snake. 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 Good job. Our next word is take, 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 three sounds, take, take, Silent E makes the A say its name. T ache. T ache. Take. T A. K. Silent E. T ache. T ache. Take. Good job. You take something, it means you take it away from somebody. The next word is spade. 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 Four sounds. Spade. A D and which way does a D go? Use your hand trick. D goes that way. A 
and the silent E makes the A say its name. Spade. 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 A spade is a garden tool that you use to dig up a garden with. Um, it's also uh, on playing cards. Spade. A D silent E Spade 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 Good job The next word is whale 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 has three sounds What makes the wha sound? If you watched our digraph video, you would know the WH is a digraph that makes the wh sound. If you don't know digraphs, go back and watch the digraph video. Wh is a WH. We put it in one box because it's one sound. Wh a o and the A makes its long sound because there's an E on the end that you can't hear. The E makes the A say its name. Whale. Wh-a-l. 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 Whale. Wh-a-l. Sonny. Digraph and ale. Wha ale. Wha ale. Whale. Good job. A whale is a giant mammal that lives in the ocean and it breathes air. It's like Jonah and the whale or Pinocchio and his father got eaten by a whale in the story Pinocchio. The next word is taste. Taste. T ace. T T ace. To taste something is, oh, uh, you got taste buds on your tongue that allow you to taste your food. T A S T And the silent E is what's making the A way over here say its name. T A S T. It's not TAST. It's T A S T because of the silent E. Taste. Taste. T A T the silent E. Taste. 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 Good job. The next word is trade. T er aid. T er aid. T er aid. T 
er, a, d. Four sounds. T, er, a, d. Remember, a d goes that way with a little hand trick. Trade. Silent E makes the A say its name. T er aid. T er aid. Trade. If you trade somebody, you're giving them something and they're giving you something back. It's a trade. T er a d silent e t er aid trade good job our last word is make make Ache, mm, ache, make, mm, ache. Three sounds. Mm, ache, mm, ache. There has to be an e on the end. Silent e because the A says its name. Mm, ache. Mm, ache. Make. Mm, ache. If you make, if you make something, you've created it. You want to make something for your mother for her birthday. Maybe you're crafty. Mm, ache, mm, ache, make. And who doesn't like arts and crafts? Good job. All right, that was great. And I look forward to seeing you again in the next video. Bye-bye.